I am so tired of feeling miserable all the time. Why does everything upset me? Why do freak out on stuff that doesn't even bother other people? I am so messed up. Oh my gosh. It is always something. Maybe you are just a drama queen. You shouldn't be sad, you should just quit crying about everything like it's the end of the world. Grow up. I know, I am such a big baby. I shouldn't be sad. I should just suck it up and act like an adult. I am sorry. I didn't mean to bring all my drama your way. Well, it happens. Just try to get a hold of yourself and remember that you don't have to always be the center of attention. You are not the only one with problems. I know you are right. I should care about others and not get so wound up in what I feel. I am sorry. Thanks, for setting me straight. I needed that. You're welcome. I know how emotional you get and out of control. You just need to be reminded that it's all in your head so you can quit feeling sorry for yourself. It's toxic. I know. I feel toxic. I am going to get a hold of myself and stop dragging you into all my drama. That's the spirit. As long as you want to improve yourself and keep a positive attitude things will get better. Positive attitude, yes, that is what I need. I am going to work on having a positive attitude. I am so miserable all the time. What is wrong with me? Why do I have to be such an emotional wreck, a drama queen? I just talked to Ted. He said I need to think positive. What do you mean by miserable? What is the emotion you are feeling that is making you miserable? I do not know I guess I felt sad and then angry, right now I just feel angry, angry at myself for being such an emotional wreck. Well it does not feel good to be sad at all and angry too. That is a lot of emotion to be carrying around. I would feel miserable too. What brought on the sadness do you think? I was thinking about my mom and how we just never seem to connect or communicate and when we try I just end up yelling at her and she ends up crying and it makes me feel bad. Bad? I think you mean sad, right? It makes sense to be sad when you are having problems with a loved one, but I am not sure about feeling bad. Am I hearing you correctly? Oh, yes, sorry to confuse you. I meant sad. It did make feel sad which made me think I was bad, you know like a bad daughter or something, for yelling at my mom and making her cry. Well, when me and my mom fight it makes me sad too because I love her and do not like to see her cry, but thinking you are bad, well that is not a fact, that is just a thought. What's the difference between being bad and feeling bad? I still feel miserable. So who cares? Well, first off in case you did not notice I care. But seriously, thinking you are bad is a judgment, and feeling bad is a consequence of judging yourself. Being sad is hard enough. Do you really need to add on the pain by judging yourself? It seems like dealing with the sadness is what needs to be approached to feel better. Doesn't judging make you feel worse? Yes, guess I do feel worse when I start to judge myself but what am I supposed to do? I don't want to feel this way. It is awful I wish it would just go away. I get it. I have ever met anyone who likes to be sad. It's an unpleasant feeling and it also an important emotion that we must experience when something is lost. What is it that you think you lost that feeling sad is trying to communicate to you? Me and my mom used to be so close when I was a little girl now all we do is argue and fight. I lost the feeling of closeness we used to have, a sense of connectedness. Well, if you feel like something was truly lost then does it really make sense to be mad at yourself for feeling sad when you have a reason to feel the way you do? Well, I guess not, but what am I supposed to do just be sad? I don't want to be sad. Unfortunately not wanting to be sad doesn't make the sad feeling go away, especially when the facts support sadness. What if you let the sadness be? Would it last forever? I guess I would feel sad for a while but it's would go away eventually in fact, 
I feel less sad than when we started talking, and I am not mad at myself anymore either. Thank you. You got through it then, that is great. Sometimes getting through difficult emotions means just letting them process on their own without judging them. I am glad I could help. You definitely did help a lot more than Ted did. Trying to think positive only made me feel worse I'm going to listen to not judge my emotions next time. Thanks for your help.